So we're out today trying to find the restaurant, cafe, something, I don't know. But this is a cute little plaza in the middle of Yerevan. They got some nice cool places here too. These are some nice condos, townhouses, luxury apartments right in the middle of city center. So why is Kim Kardashian famous in Armenia? Well, the Kardashians link to Armenia comes from Kim's great great grandparents, a connection that many would consider kind of tenuous at its best. But the Kardashians have always been vocal about their, Arme Ar their Armenian heritage, none more so than Kim. Armenia in the capital city of Yerevan, which we're located, the population is 2,777,000. It's expected to grow to about 2.95 million by the end of 2023. Armenia sits between two seas, the Black and Capsian, and two continents, Europe and Asia. So walking around, we found this cute little quaint breakfast place. That coffee, y'all, was so delicious. I love this environment because it was so smooth, so tranquil, and everybody here is really, really nice. When I tell you I felt at home, I really did. I felt at home. I'm drinking my water, trying to stay hydrated, and we had some great conversation with the staff here. They gave us a lot of insight about this little community and the revitalization of it. It's a lot of work people, as I mentioned, in this area. Uh, some people live here as well, regular residents, but most of it is uh, professional people. So this area is consistently evolving and the plants gave me life too, you guys. They had an abundance of beautiful plants in the window and I wanted to get that nice green feeling. So we kept hearing somebody singing, and I'm like, where is that sound coming from? Sounds so beautiful. Look to the right, and a street vendor. His voice was so tranquil, and he was so cool. So after listening to that nice tranquil music, we decided to hit the road again and keep walking to see what we find in Yerevan. Because they finished practice. This dude, him and his brother, then took our massages that were scheduled for it. they daddy and me. I know. <laughs> How did the massage feel? Feel great. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. All right. They deserve it. They've been playing hard and they're amazing sons. Your mama loves you. I love my mama and daddy. All right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Armenia, what's your name? Uh, Javier. Javier? Yeah, Kobe. 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 Uh, Kobe. Kobe Bryant? Xavier. You heard of Kobe Bryant? What's my name? Arut Ah. Okay, okay. What's up? Arut. Javier, Jai, Kobe. Ah. Ah, so. Ah, boy. Yeah. Ask him, what's his name, man? How are you? 25. 23. <laughs> 25? Sir. 23. 23. Yeah. 25, huh? Yes, sir. 25. Uh, so. 2, 3. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so. so we just got dropped off by the cab. Well, not the cab. The, what's the name? So we just got dropped off to 
walk up to the Cascade, which is a monument here, a historic monument. And so we're excited about seeing it. Bye bye. You say bye, y'all. Bye bye. Bye bye. Walking up now. <laughs> right. <laughs> I don't. Does it go that high? According to all the YouTube videos, I look at it. Okay, this is something that we looked at up on YouTube, historic sites in Armenia, and this is one of them. It's Cascade, that's the name of it, Cascade. So, let's see what the community looks like. Y'all ready? And they have a game today, so we know that they're not gonna walk these steps. Ooh wee We gotta go down here and do that. Oh. Mm -hmm. They said it was. That's called Black Cat. So building the Cascade Monument began in the 1970s and it was partially completed in 1981. A second phase lasted through the mid 2000s, bringing in work of modern art from the Armenian American collector, Gerard Leon. Currently there are 572 steps here at Cascade. So you may ask, what is the significance of Yerevan Cascade? In short, it is a giant staircase located in the center of the city, and it is one of the main tourist attractions in Yerevan. This massive structure connects with the upper parts of Yerevan, Victory Park, Arabic, and Kanaker. I apologize if I'm mispronouncing that. As I mentioned, there are 572 steps on the cascade and the total elevation change from the bottom of the staircase to the top to the memorial of the 50th anniversary of Soviet Armenia is 118 meters. This is one of the most impressive buildings you will see in Yerevan and a great example of Soviet architecture in Yerevan itself. I've never seen so many stray dogs running around, but evidently the people love the dogs because they are just so homey and comfortable wherever they are. So me and Mr. Womack, we gonna take our chances and walk up these steps to see how far we get before I get tired. And as you can see, I didn't make it far. <laughs> he went all the way up to the top. I'm just gonna sit here and gaze and people watch. Okay, y'all, I'm walking up these steps. And it is a walk for sure. I'm getting my workout on today. Yes! Whew. I need to be careful so I don't fall. I did it! Yay! So after walking all day, we got a little hungry and found this Mexican restaurant right in the plaza. It smells so good. It looks pretty. I'm ready to eat. <laughs> and you know we love Mexican. Everything on this menu looks 
so good. I don't know what to get. So the bathrooms here are male and female. And you just have to wait until male or female come out. <laughs> Unisex bathrooms. <laughs>